Hi, I want to quickly show you component installation procedure for Intel NUC i3. It is a new Haswell model. Here we have uh, two me memory modules. Uh, we have a SSD, we have a wireless, and we have two and a half uh, inch hard drive because this is H model. To unscrew the case, just standard Phillips screwdriver will do. Let's lift this, pivot this, and now the first component is wireless card. This is probably the most complicated component to install because of small fidgety wires. And connectors are also not that big. So let's put it at an angle. And then use the screw that we just replaced to hold it. Oops, you need to push it all the way. Okay. So now we take antenna connectors. There's a piece of cloth that we need to remove. Or it's not a cloth, it's some piece of polyester. But close enough. Okay. And now we have uh, two antenna connectors. <sighs> Notice that connector is really really small and wire is uh, not that flexible so you need to carefully find the exact spot uh, where they will fit into one another don't force anything okay this one fits now the second one if it's not that correct angle you can twist a little bit the whole wire don't twist the connector head. And again, you need to find the exactly proper spot for it. Uh, by the way, I'm doing this from the side so you guys have a better view. Although my hands prevent this. So it's a bit harder than it should be. Ah, fit. Whew, this was exhausting. And this is the worst part of installation. Everything after that is really easy. So, as we did before, let's remove screw for SSD. We remove screw, add SSD at an angle. It will hold itself. Lower it down, replace the screw. Memory, just put it in again at an angle and press down. To remove memory back, just press it both side connectors, it will pop back up. So we want memory in. Oops. Another piece of memory in, and that is all. Now carefully pivot this connector back. You have two holes. One hole is for power connector, this slightly bigger one, and one is for SATA cable. Watch that you don't mess up the SATA cable. When you have it approximately in the place, just slide the connector, uh, just slide the hard drive in. And perfect. Uh, if you wish, you can put uh, these uh, two screws he here and uh, here. They should come with your uh, NUC. Uh, I will put them later because frankly I have no idea where my uh, NUC package is. So let's... Okay, it all, all fits nicely. Let's replace the bottom and that is it.